Come to the east. Do God's work and be rewarded not only with nebulous concepts of salvation and eternity, but also with land and plunder. That was the promise of the Teutonic Order, and the reason that they could rely on a steady supply of battle-hungry knights. Christians of low noble birth, who were easily tempted to try their luck in Lithuania. It was a scheme as ingenious as it was devious, and far from the holy mission that they spoke of publicly. After the Saracens ousted them from their holy land and stripped away their Middle Eastern estates, these crusaders now planted their iron heels on our backs to sate their lust for blood and plunder. When Algirdas was forced to deal with the defiant city-states of Rutinia, wreaking havoc on the Lithuanian borderlands, the opportunistic Teutons saw a chance to invade our homeland yet again. Believing that western Lithuania lay open while Algirdas was occupied in the east, they marched into our lands. They were not expecting to face Kestutis, who had stayed behind to hold the heartland. But Kestutis was expecting them, and lay in wait, eager to teach these sword-swinging marauders a lesson. I will once again deal with the haughty crusader bandits who foolishly invade our realm. I leave Rutinia to you, Algidas. Neither the fanatical order nor the battle-hardened Rufinians can oppose us. If we remain united and keep our ranks disciplined, onwards! Uh, let's get all of the upgrades. Oh, I can't afford it now. There's so much to do at the start of this mission. Oh, Canadian club. Ooh. Hey, Zab, how are you? Uh, you here? You here? Uh, let's put some on stone. I do get in for these. That's one of the. I'm guessing that's one of the castle areas. That's the second castle, that's the third castle. Okay, and the monasteries and everything over here. I think it's probably easier to push this side. So maybe we play aggressive this side, plays a castle this side. Where's the other woodline I had? Oh, they're both on the one side, because this side has no wood, pretty much. But it has some, but it's not great. I just know where I can build lumber camp. Passing through buildings again? Oh god. Another thanks to E moment. See if we can find the Tatar refugees. I have a feeling that will make my mission much easier. At least I have decent farm counts already. And that's actually going to be number four. I need to change the order in which I have these. Because this side is the one I'm focusing more on at the moment. Let's go to blue first because the score is lower. 
Uh, I can't get that. I like the new Arabia. I think the hills are a little bit extreme at the moment. Oh, that'll be this side probably. Nope, it's it. Am I getting attacked by the Tudor Gold? I don't see any of the Tudor Gold are attacking. Okay. Meta arms to the rescue. This is like doing a novus. Um, I'm actually kind of losing this. I guess having no bodkin really does hurt in this situation. Uh, Bloodlines is already in. Of course, it's fortified. Okay, this side I want that castle going up. I think I should have dropped a third TC. <laughs> Say more and more money against the Ruthenians. Just for you, Salmon. <laughs> I will now. <laughs> He's right in the south corner. He's here, don't worry. <laughs> okay, we should almost be able to click imp here. Luckily, they're just wasting their resources. Let's click up to him. Oh, Kask is first. I think he means um, that from the patch he was excited and now he's disappointed. Oh, that, yeah, that new rear view, though. Okay, this side we're gonna get our castle going as well, actually. Not sure why they keep sending men at arms to just die miserably. I need more on woods. Uh, let's get Bodkin as well. Come on. 
Maybe we should drop the third TC. You can still meta arms for berries though. Very comfortably, because the berries are super exposed at the moment. Let's do that. Okay, a couple of traps from this castle would be good. Let's get conscription from this castle. Oh no! Okay, I think it's just okay. Tempted to go to Hussar. <laughs> when am I not, though? Uh, we need some leaders on this side as well, I think. Round and round the castle. Da 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 We need to get murder holes for this. I can't be bothered bikering around. <laughs> Still sending feudal age archers, that's funny. Oh, what's up? I'm a little bit surprised they didn't just like add it as a secondary upgrade rather than just completely removing Hussar upgrade for these. But I guess it'd be the risk of having it be too strong. Murder Hulls finally in? It is, okay, good. <laughs> Utile Age Military is still, oh my god. I don't even have Castle Age eco upgrades either. Uh, Castle Age upgrades for those. Am I getting attacked by something? Oh, I've got Wing Passar over here. There we go. This is why we get ballistics, even though we're not making units that require ballistics. Build out. Okay, we finally clean this. I don't I gotta keep stop sending them from this side as well. This is why using uh select all buildings can really screw you. How bad is this? I'm looking great, but I'm not looking too bad yet. You're gonna get chemistry as well. Imagine if they had that bonus that they used to have where the Hussar benefited from. Uh, what's it called? From the relics still. 
That pulled the boy. That's true, Laura. And for some reason, because the AI likes making my life miserable, it also seems pretty legitimate here. Oh, they ally, absolutely. Uh, is that no more gold? Oh, it's not gold over there. Wait, is oh, it's, that's only one of the monasteries to destroy. Oh wow, thank you very much. The winged hussar eats everything. We will not allow such destruction to happen again. Stay away from our lands, Lithuanians. Uh, let's get that relic in. The FCA killed them all. Wow. Salmon's continued hatred for the CA now out of hand. Really should be making more villages than I currently am. Um, you guys can all come here. I might even get elite leeches as well. Oh, they even got long sword finally. Absolute try hard, I know, right? Yeah, there's two here that we can use to start pushing here. I see other stables on this side. Is there any one? Okay. It feels so slow to try and clean this entire base. I'm gonna get Cavalier upgrade as well. Please don't tell me because I allied with them they're gonna turn on me now. <laughs> that would not be great. I don't know them, I just absolutely adore the campaigns. Fuck going for that. Oh, I'm actually at pop cap. There's another relic over there. Let's go for the last. How did the last shot miss, though? Some Tatar Kipchak horse archers have gathered in our castle and are eager to join us in battle. Ooh. 
That's fun. Go dive with this. Or not. Lithuanians dare to launch a counter-attack! Send me riders to our brethren of the Livonia and request their support against this heathen rebel. Heathen rebel. <laughs> So dramatic. We have received your message and are on our way. Together, sweep the Lithuanians off the map. Like some bothersome flies. Okay, so these are about to be dead. I need to go back to the mall. I had to do some mall. There he is. Oh shit. Oh, uh, something to see here. Let's just send back all of these. Lithuanians have conquered one of our fortresses. Which dark forces have they solicited to achieve this? Attack! Make short work of them! We must submit to Algirdas and Kestitis. The Knights of the Livonian Order have arrived in the north. Our scouts say that they've even brought siege weapons. How dare they? Siege weapons are cheating. Come on, get rid of that. I don't even remember clicking Paladin, but I definitely want Paladin. I think it's easier to attack from here. Algirdas has been wounded. Quick, take him to the physicians. We'll have to continue the fight without him while he recovers. Oh, they're here. That's not where I thought they were coming from. I thought they'd be supporting on the other side. <laughs> okay, we're just gonna make a new TC down here. It's fine. That'll be a boyar, that's why it is dying. Uh, let's build a castle here real quick. At least one of them managed it. You can run further up. <laughs> There's had too much army everywhere. Really hard to keep track of where everything is. Wait, where did the monk go? Must have died somewhere. Except for these ones which need to be over here somewhere. Oh, there's gold over here. Well, I can place the mining camp anywhere nice, but still. No! Fuck! Oh my god, that's bad. Okay, well, we need more castles anyway. Have I still not dealt with this? Guess who this has been injured? Bring him to safety. 
Bandit and bandage his wounds. Oh, it looks like they didn't end up playing that. Oh, shit. At least these are cleaning up a lot of eco. Can we deal with this now? So I thought there's way too many paladin there. There's so much wood to- Oh, I didn't want to send them in. It's too late. I just lost them all. No. Well. Guess we make the best of a bad situation. Use the military map. I don't have military to have on the map at the moment. <laughs> That's the issue. I need Ecor. Is my. <laughs> hey, Mikael. How are you doing? You went to sleep like only five hours ago. Yeah, true. Thank you for the follow, Kevin, baby. I need one more castle to, to finish this side, I think. God damn it, I wish I got seed in the ears of the Lithuanians. They still setting more shit my way. No, no, please, please have mercy. <laughs> Damn it, I actually went and cleaned it up. I think my brain cells have gone to mush. The panic attacks? Oh man, I hope that uh, they subside soon if they haven't already. That's rough. Lots and lots of Hussar and Letus.
Okay. At least these are finally. Oh, they resigned. Okay, good. I should have probably just sent my entire army to deal with it as soon as it started. Oh, that's actually not great. Um. I wish that when you issued a command to the Trebs that it wouldn't just uh, kind of derp out a little bit. I'm behind to wonder if this is easier to push. We have five Trebs in this one. Uh, just attack this one. Damn it. Oh, I need a the other castle produce these. There we go. That one damage per hit. Oh, actually, because they're not elites. Oh, allying with the Tatars is the best idea ever. Where's the other monastery? Maybe back here they'll be there? One over there. Okay, there's way too many powered in this side. I think I only have a couple of stables in this side, now I think about it. Yeah, I don't have a university, so I can't even see if I have triple train as an option. Uh, you want to stare anywhere? I only see the two. I must do this somewhere out of my face. Really? That's kind of cool in a way. We admit defeat. Will you accept Thank you. We will serve you now. No, I want to make sure that you suffer for the amount of pain you put me through. No. <laughs> Damn, those new Crusader Knights are actually hell to kill. See how long it takes to get my entire army over there to deal with this. So deleting every single villager. This one's name was Salmon. <laughs> oh, actually, I only have six on wood, that's fine though. Let's go and do an assault on this base. The one you don't like guiding the rest of them. God for Lisa's. I think this would be a much more painful fight without them. Oh, wow. So, I mean, it's feel, this mission feels like it's been going way longer than it actually has. Now to just park these underneath the towers and get rid of the castle, and hopefully, that'll be the end of the mission. 
I don't think you really notice just how much of a difference having uh, Siege Engineers makes until you play a Civ without. The Antichrist himself, Jesus. That's a bit uh, over the top, don't you think? Taking a while to process that the mission's over. What a triumph! The wicked crusaders are defeated. Ruthenia is subdued. Uh -oh. Our success will not have gone unnoticed. The spies of the Golden Horde are everywhere. <laughs> exactly, Salmon. The Grand Master of the Order had greatly underestimated the resourceful brothers. It seemed that Algirdas and Kestutis were invincible whenever they joined forces. Exasperated, the Teutonic Order was forced to give up its invasion plans. At least for a time. The war with the Order was a long and bloody affair. But in the end, Kestutis repelled the invaders. He was thenceforth known as the Steadfast for his stubborn defense and loyalty to his brother. Once Algirdas arrived to help, the brothers even managed to conquer several important Teutonic fortresses. But their quick triumph made steadfast Kestutis careless. During a skirmish, retreating crusaders captured and dragged him to one of the Teutonic border fortresses. Perhaps the Crusaders even put chains on him, like those that we wear right now. I like to think that they did. But, in any case, Kestutis did not remain a prisoner for long. With the help of a loyal servant, he broke a hole in the three-meter-thick wall of his cell, while Algirdas distracted the Crusader guards with a feigned attack. In the chaos that ensued, Kestutis left the castle on horseback, dressed as a Teutonic knight. <laughs> 